I just really don't want to try this one. And I just know it's the rotisserie chicken. Because it's the only one left. And it's just a coincidence that it be the last one. And the only one. It just sounds disgusting. Like, I just know I'm not going to like it. What's up? It's your girl Ajane with a capital I and today your girl is back with another mother loving video. Anyways, in today's video we will be trying out different flavored Pringles. Um, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to be trying to figure out what flavor I did try and then rate it from 1 to 10. So what I'm going to do is I'm about to go ahead and stack about 4 Pringles on each Pringle top and then write the name of the Pringle on the actual Pringle paper. And that's how I know if I got it, you know, wrong or right. Alrighty, um, so your girl already went to Myers and got um, all the different flavor Pringles that they already had available. And it was about 14 or 13 of them that they had. So we're about to go ahead and get straight into this video. Let's go. Alright y'all, so I already went ahead and got everything set up. So I'm going to go ahead and just mix up the order a little bit just before I get started. Also, I got a list on my phone of different flavors to refer to because I don't know all the flavors by heart. So, but we're just going to get straight into it. Try this one first. Oh, that one easy. This one is um definitely original. I know that for sure. Oh my god. It's definitely sour cream and onion. What is going on with my taste buds? Hold on. Okay, it's getting to me. Now that I know what it is. Okay. Oh wow, that is so crazy. Now I'm going to try this one. Let me see. From the looks of it, it's like kind of red. So, it might be one of the hot ones. Honestly, no. I think that might be pizza. Um, also, I forgot to rate that one. Um, that's how cream onion. I'd have had that before, so I rate that probably like a a nine, a nine for sure. Um, I definitely believe that this is pizza. Um, and <clears throat> I hope I'm right. <laughs> Yeah, I'm definitely right. I don't know if y'all can see this or not. But it's a pizza on one. Heck yeah. I got one right so far, one wrong. Okay, okay. Let's see. I'm gonna go ahead with this one since it wanna start sliding off. Okay, let's see, let's see. So it's definitely wavy. So I know that's for sure. Um, let's see what it's tasting like. Oh my god, y'all, I had to go get some pepper top because that one was disgusting, but that's definitely giving me very much wavy applewood smoked cheddar for sure. And that shit is nasty. Yeah, that was that. And <clears throat> so I got that I got that right, but mm -mm, never again. I thought I was in the garbage. That was so disgusting. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and go with another wavy. Put in a little wavy. Okay. This one seemed easy. I smelled it. It smelled kind of like barbecue. Um, 
Mm-hmm. Yeah. That one is definitely wavy sweet and spicy barbecue. That's good. I give that one a an eight. But that last one is definitely a zero for me. Definitely a zero for me. Um since there's only one more wavy left, I'm gonna go ahead with the wavy, stay on the wavy streak. Um, so this one should be easy. It's only one left. It is the wavy fire roasted jalapeno. Let's see if it's good though. I don't really know. That one, it's kind of tricky. Cause this, when you first try it, it's like, hold on. Mmm. -hmm. It's just like different. But it's not bad, but it's not like tasty either. But you could taste the jalapeno part in it. And I like, I wouldn't eat the whole can, if that makes sense. It is not one of my favorites. So from a one to 10, um, I'd probably rate that like a, that's giving me very much five, definitely five. So only one of the wavy ones is really good for and that's the sweet and spicy barbecue at the moment. All right, so now I'm going to go ahead and try. It's two red ones, so I'm going to go ahead and knock those out. Maybe these are spicy. Let's see. Mm -hmm. It's definitely scorching. It's definitely scorching. Yeah. Um, however, I don't know if it's scorching barbecue or scorching cheddar. I don't know. Yeah, it's, mm. it's not like it's not like really hot, but it do sneak up on you for a Pringle. So let's see. You know how like with a Pringle, sometimes you gotta take your tongue and like mash it up with the roof of your mouth to like get the flavor out. I don't know. Anyways, I just did that, and I came up with um, scorching cheddar. So let's see. Yeah, I was right. Let's go to check. Okay, yeah. Okay. Um. Oh, and I get that one definitely. I like hot stuff, so I get that one definitely a, a nine. I will eat those. I'm gonna go ahead with this last little red one. Of course, it's gonna be scorching barbecue. That's the only scorching one left, so. Okay. I'll get out in a 10 as well. That one good. We're gonna go ahead with this orange one. Of course, I believe this one will be cheddar. Mm-hmm. That's definitely cheddar. That's how it's right. Um, I'm gonna go with this one. This one don't really have a taste, so it most definitely must be, I'm thinking lightly salted. If this original, then I can only imagine what lightly salted must taste like. But, I definitely think this may be lightly, <laughs> oh wow, it's original. So now I'm gonna go ahead and go with, I'm gonna go with this one. Mm -hmm. But I'm not gonna do dark in it though. Not for real. Uh -uh. I'm not really liking that one. And it's. I'm not really like. Oh hell no! Nah. That one is zero for me. Um, a negative two. Is that what I ate? This can't be what I ate. But that was buffalo ranch. And it was definitely disgusting. I didn't like that. It had me thinking it was rotisserie chicken. That one was definitely a negative one for me. Um, I really can't believe that one actually tastes like that because when my boyfriend first opened them and I actually tried it, which I wasn't supposed to before this video, it didn't taste like that. That's why it's really like tripping me out. Like, mm -hmm. maybe I need to just try it one more time. But I'm gonna just take a little tiny bite. <laughs> It's 
still giving me a no. Definitely giving me a no. I'm gonna go ahead and try this one. I don't know this one. I think this might just be regular barbecue. I like this. Definitely regular barbecue. Yup. Heck yeah. I like that kind. That's definitely a 10 for me. Now I'm scared. Cause I only got two left. I know it's rotisserie chicken for sure. And that's what I'm scared to try. And the lightly salted. Any mini mini moats I know. This one. They don't really like have no flavor, so this definitely lightly salted. Yeah. But the lightly salted ones actually taste way better than the original Pringles. It's definitely giving Lay's, the yellow bag. I just really don't want to try this one, and I just know it's the rotisserie chicken, because it's the only one left. And it's just a coincidence that it be the last one, and the only one. It just sound disgusting, like, I just know I'm not going to like it. And by the way, the lightly salted, I definitely would give that a... A 10 honestly it's up there with the barbecue and everything else that was in the 9 10 range it was definitely good but this shit about to be disgusting but mm -hmm. uh, I just got the little like powder on my tongue and it's like reminded me a lot a chicken noodle packet. Oh, oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Ugh. I cannot finish that. That is so disgusting. That was definitely a zero, and I knew that was definitely a negative seven. That was so disgusting. I knew it was gonna be disgusting. Mm -mm. That's definitely another can that's going in the garbage. I will never eat that again. Ugh. Never again. I honestly don't even know why they came up with that kind. I mean, maybe somebody like it, but not me. But anyway, y'all, I'm just trying to get that taste out of my mouth, but this will be the end of this video. This will be the end of the video. Let's go ahead, like this video, subscribe to my channel. Also, don't forget to comment down below if you want me to try out any challenges, um, you want me to try out any products, anything new, um, anything, anything whatsoever. Uh, comment down below um, or message me, DM me on any social medias. Hit that subscribe button and don't forget to hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any more new videos because another video is coming really, really soon. Talk to y'all later. Bye.